I've been working as an artist, mixed media artist, for as long as I can remember. Um, digital work just sort of fell into my lap. I really didn't, uh, somebody presented me with a pad and uh, I'm just experimenting and doodling around. It's become an, um, my sketch pad, basically. Um, it's replaced paper. Um, it's, I don't know, I really don't think about how I'm marketing any of my stuff. Uh, it is really a, a, a hobby. I, I, I paint it for a living and I do digital work as a hobby. <laughs> you know, when most people say that they paint as a hobby, when they do other, you know, other things. So, um, and, and a, but a lot of commercial things have actually fallen into place after the, after the fact of the works having been done. So, limitless directions. Uh, there are lots of possibilities, lots of impossibilities as well. The idea of printing out your work that you've done with a stylus or a finger on a screen. There is no such thing as a physical artwork. It's a, it's a, it's a digital imprint that you make on some sort of a, uh, a page that you open in an app application. Um, it can be done on, in, in, on anything, uh, on phones. Uh, actually, I did have a phone a few years back that had very simplistic application on the phone that had a, um, a drawing panel. Um, very small resolution, but uh, almost stamp sort of size. But, um, and the possibilities of that. I do not play games. I hate the idea of playing games on, on computers. So this is my alternative. I, I actually just experiment, continue experimenting. The whole good thing about the app is if you make a wrong, a wrong turning somewhere, there are all these back buttons that take you very quickly back to a place where you can restart. Really